All right, Tom, let's check out one of your runs here. Some GS up on South Pole. Watch it first here, regular motion, then we'll slow it down. Some pretty good stuff. And then your first weekend of GS training ever. It's going good. Top here. A little far away, but pretty good position. Looks to be, you know, kind of level. Appears to be leveled by the panel. However, looks like your outside arm, as soon as it's far away, but kind of dragging behind you. Remember, we want to, we talked about kind of bring that forward and Call, you know, wipe the counter, sweep that arm forward, get it, get it out over the downhill ski. Helps you get over the downhill ski. You know, decent move here. Move forward, hips over your, over the um, the boots, not standing up too tall. Yeah, a little lean, eh, you know, not bad. Maybe you can see inside hand just a little bit lower than the outside hand. Um, not bad, though. Nice long outside leg, short inside leg. Looks like we got ankle flexion in both. You know, maybe just, just a hair. We could be a little more level, be a little more balanced over the outside ski, and you kind of see it here. Right, kind of leaning in a little bit there, right? See, not terribly level, but um, this is one big sweeping turn, so this is the undergate, so it could make some sense. So, um, you know, decent turn there. All right, came up here, got yourself outside rise line, bringing shape back to the pole. Um, I like that. And level there. Forward pole plant. You know, good line. I mean, you're really weighty, you're patient. Start at the turn to bring shape back to the pole. You know, maybe be just a hair more level, that outside hand. You can't really see it, but if we just brought that out over the downhill ski. think that would help. You know, there again, it's just not, you know, not, not exactly level. Kind of here too. Now here we got a little uh, some terrain. We're going over this little roll here, and it looks like you know because you were kind of a li little bit leaning in, a lot of spray down there, right there. All right. So what are we gonna do? Anytime we're gonna roll over something, we really have to you know move forward and, and press on the other side. Make sure we're moving forward, going from something where the hill drops out a little bit. Looks like you didn't move forward and really press, get on that outside ski. You know, your outside hand's kind of high. You can see a little just kind of tipping in a bit there. Um, you know, because I think, you know, big skid in here, I don't think you were really prepared for this one yet, so you kind of maybe toss them sideways at the top of the turn and get your inside hand, well, I mean, your new outside hand kind of back. And eventually brought it around and straightened it out. So good job there. Again, just a little bit of a, a little bit of a, uh, you know, not quite level as we'd like. We really want level shoulders by the panel. It's okay up here. When we go by them, that was a good job. Yeah, 
seems just not quite level. So, you know, being level really helps us, you know, get on the outside ski. This is an outside ski dominated event. You know, so we want to be balanced over the outside ski, really pressure on that outside ski. So let's work on that. Let's work on what we talked about, kind of wiping the counter motion, sweeping the outside hand will help us, you know, reach out over the out, that downhill ski with that outside hand. Um, trying to really strive to be level by the panel. But otherwise, that was darn good skiing. What a great start. A lot of good things to come.